Washington County, Tennessee schools rolling out a new app. The goal is to help parents track school buses. Some changes have been made to bus routes with new start times. The app gives parents a better idea of where the bus is and when it's going to get to their house. I think it helps us with the trust issue and, and parents understanding that, that we want them to, to know what's going on and it's a good way to communicate without burdening everybody. Parents don't have to worry about others using the app as each user will have to have a unique student ID. Now as students head back to school it's important that everyone does their part to keep children safe while they're waiting for the bus. Parents, make sure your student knows where the bus stop is and that they are at least five minutes before the bus is scheduled to arrive. And be sure your child knows how to stay safe, stay at least 10 feet or five giant steps from the curb. Always wait until the bus comes to a complete stop and the driver signals for you to board. Face forward after finding a seat on the bus and only exit the bus after it comes to a full stop and check both ways for cars before crossing a street. Drivers, of course, need to watch carefully for those yellow flashing lights. That means a bus is preparing to stop to load or unload children, so slow down and prepare to stop. And those red flashing lights are non-negotiable. Extended signs indicate the bus has reached its stop and that children are getting out. You must stop your vehicle and wait until the lights stop flashing. The arm is withdrawn and the bus begins moving again before you start driving. And even when you don't see lights flashing on the bus, be cautious. Watch for children, especially in the morning or mid-afternoon.